Hello friends, we are going to draw a flowchart to find the biggest of two numbers. So this is the logical start of the flowchart. I am obtaining two numbers. Input A and B. I am checking if A greater than B. If A greater than B, it is is true means print print a so I'm printing the biggest number is a if it is false means False means I am again checking if B greater than A. B greater than A. If it is true, if it is true. I am printing print B. If B greater than A means I am printing B. Otherwise, false means false means I am printing print print a comma b or equal equal so that's it so this is the logical end of the flowchart stop and connecting uh, all the lines That's it. So this is the flowchart to find the biggest of given two numbers. I'm obtaining input a and b. If a greater than b, I'm printing a. Otherwise, I'm checking if b greater than a. If b greater than a, true means I'm printing b. If a greater than b is false, again b greater than a also false. That means a is not greater than b and b is not greater than b. That means a and b are equal. So this is the flowchart to find the biggest of two numbers. We check all the possible condition a greater than b b greater than a and b greater than a uh, and both conditions are checked and if both are false then a and b are equal. We will uh, try uh, some inputs and giving a equal to 100, b equal to 50. In this case we will check a greater than b true print a that means the 100 will get printed. Now I am giving another scenario a is 50, b is 150. It will check 50 greater than 150. It will say a greater than b. 50 greater than 150 is false. Then we come to the next condition b greater than a. That means 150 greater than 50 is true. Then it will print b. It will print 150. And if, if I am giving a equal to 100, b equal to 100. So in this case, what will happen? We get check 100 greater than 100. 
100 greater than 100, A greater than B, it is also false. Again, to check, B greater than A. Again, this 100 greater than 100 is also false. It is different. A and B 100, 100 are equal. So, equal 100, 100 are equal is my result. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, share, comment and press the bell button. Thank you.